Welcome to the He's Got Issues DC Comics Edition number 191.2. I'm John Cooney here to preview new DC Comics being released September 16th, 2015, beginning alphabetically with Batman Ark Knight Genesis number 2 of 6, a story spawned by the smash hit game of the summer, Batman Arkham Knight, the origin of the enigmatic Arkham Knight continues. Don't miss our stunning second issue, the details of which are too hot for solicits. Need we say more? Next we have Bizarro number 4 of 6. Sigum, look out Zatanna, you're about to meet your match in backwards magic spells when Bizarro and Jimmy break up your act in Branson, Missouri. We've also got Black Canary number 4, guest artist Pia Guerra of Why the Last Man joins the series. Dinah is on the hunt for her kidnapped guitarist Ditto, and when she finds the person responsible, you better believe she'll make them pay. Also uncover the secret of the band's former singer and how she plans to exact revenge on them for kicking her out. Next, we have Constantine the Hellblazer number four. Some very, very, very bad news sends John Constantine on a magical bender through the darkened streets of London. This one's gonna hurt in the morning. Next, we have Doom number four. It's Wonder Girl vs. Doomed on the streets of Metropolis. Riser is just a regular everyday teenager who changes into a huge poisonous Doom monster. But all that turns upside down when he gets the chance to meet his big crush. The only problem is, Wonder Girl's idea of crush is beating Doomed senseless. Next we have Dr. Fate number 4. Now an ancient god wants to destroy him, a mystical flood threatens to drown him, and the riddle of the Sphinx eludes him. Also, homework. We've also got Green Lantern, The Lost Army, number four. Things are looking grim for the Lost Corps members. With tensions running high, the brewing distrust between Kilowog and Guy Gardner comes to a head. Next, we have Harley Quinn, number 20. Like Los Angeles didn't have enough problems with DC Comics moving in, now Harley Quinn is determined to take over Tinseltown. She's an overnight entertainment sensation, but will the industry survive Harley's 15 minutes of fame? We've also got Injustice Gods Among Us Year 4, number 10. Harley Quinn breaks out of her prison on Olympus, tells Wonder Woman where her mother is being held, and reveals the real manipulator behind the scenes. And when Superman unexpectedly departs into space, an alliance of world leaders decides the time is right to strike. Next, we have Martian Manhunter number 4. What is tying four individuals around the world to the ghost of John Jones, and will they find out before they're torn to pieces by the unstoppable Martian Maneater? We've also got Prez number four. The American Century program creates a PR nightmare for President Beth Ross, while a hinky experiment in artificial intelligence produces a killer robot with a taste for musicals. Plus, an eccentric trillionaire forces senators to live with the consequences of their own laws. Next, we have Robin, son of Batman number four. It's Robin versus Deathstroke. The troubles in Maya's past come back to haunt her. Will Damien and Goliath be forced to leave her to fend for herself, or can they find a way to help their new ally? We've also got Secret 6, number 6. What is the secret? Actually, there's more than one, and the answers are revealed here. The true identity of Mockingbird was only one of the secrets, and it's not even the most shocking. Plus, a marriage that shouldn't happen is proposed. A person you thought was long gone returns and at least one of the six is not the person you think they are. Okay, it's the dummy. From this point on, all bets are off. Next, we have Sensation Comics featuring Wonder Woman number 14. It takes nine days, the gods say, for an anvil to fall to Earth from Olympus. But what happens when it strikes the world of men? Nyx, primordial god of night, is indifferent to the fate of the mortals below when she decides to teach her daughter Strife a lesson. Diana has nine days to step between two warring factions of godhood and stave off a disaster for those caught in the crossfire. We've also got Superman Wonder Woman number 21. The epic truth arc hits close to the heart as dark secrets come to light, forcing Superman and Wonder Woman to question whether their relationship can work in this new world of identities revealed and questionable actions. And we have Wonder Woman number 44. Wonder Woman is on the trail of Donna Troy, who seeks refuge in London from both Diana and her past. But a new friend may be more trouble than help for the fleeing Amazon outcast. Out in Trades this week, we have 100 Bullets Volume 3 trade paperback. These standalone stories from issues 37 through 57 of the Eisner Award-winning series spotlight the major players in the story, plus the final fate of Luke Hughes. 
Next, we have Batman War Hush Hardcover, the epic thrillers presented in stark black and white. In this story of murder, mystery, and romance, Batman sets out to discover the identity of the mysterious villain wreaking havoc in his life. But Batman ends up facing what might be the most intense case of his life as secrets from his past flood into the present. And the most notorious villains to ever haunt Gotham City streets attack simultaneously. Guest starring the Dark Knight's greatest allies and enemies, this collection features Batman number 608 to 619, as well as the six-page chapter from Wizard Zero and a two-page origin story that originally appeared at DCComics.com. We've also got Batman Volume 7 Endgame hardcover. The Joker is back in these stories from Batman 35 through 40. For years, the Joker has regarded Batman with a sick, twisted love. But now the Clown Prince of Crime is done playing. He's going to kill Batman, and he's going to do it using those whom Batman loves the most, the Justice League. The Joker returns to Gotham City with a deadlier agenda than ever before, using every tool at his disposal to finally kill the Dark Knight. That includes turning Batman's allies against him in the bloodiest brawl that he's ever had to survive. Next, we have Flash Season Zero Trade Paperback. Follow the adventures of Barry Allen from issues 1 through 12 of this new series as he struggles to balance his job as a police crime scene investigator, his unrequited crush on Iris West, and his new life as Central City's guardian angel. We've also got New Teen Titans Volume 3 Trade Paperback. In these New Titans Tales from issues 17 through 20 and Tales in the New Teen Titans number 1 through 4, a childhood friend of Kid Flash is in trouble and the Titans join together to help her. And after a battle that almost destroys the Titans Tower, it becomes clear that there is someone very powerful at work behind the scenes. And we have Swamp Thing by Scott Snyder, Deluxe Edition Hardcover. In these stories from Swamp Thing number 0 through 18, Annual number 1, and Animal Man number 12 and 17, Anton Arcane attempts to destroy the red and the green as Rot World ensnares Animal Man and Swamp Thing. Okay, so that's it for DC this week, but there's still plenty of other books out as well, so be sure to check out my YouTube channel at he'sgotissues.com to see both the Marvel and Indies videos for this week, as well as my usual roundup with all my favorites for the week with a little more depth and insight than you get here. And if you like these videos, be sure to let me know by leaving a comment and subscribing. And you can now find He's Got Issues on eBay at he'sgotissues.com slash eBay for great deals on comics, trades, and lots of superhero and pop culture merchandise. And of course, you can always follow He's Got Issues on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, Tumblr, and Instagram to see everything I'm reading as I read it. So until next week, I'm John Cooney, and I've got issues.